Which of the following has a double bond? A hydrogen chloride molecule, a peroxide ion, a nitrogen molecule, or a phosphorus fluoride molecule? The first step in determining the Lewis structure of a diatomic molecule is to count the number of valence electrons. To do that, we first locate the atoms in the periodic table. Hydrogen is located in group 1A, therefore it has one valence electron. Fluorine and chlorine belong to group 7A, therefore each fluorine or chlorine atom has seven valence electrons. Oxygen belongs to group 6A, therefore each oxygen atom has six valence electrons. Finally, nitrogen and phosphorus belong to group 5A, therefore each atom of nitrogen or phosphorus has five valence electrons. To summarize, hydrogen has one valence electron, chlorine has seven, oxygen has six, nitrogen has five, phosphorus has five, and fluorine has seven. Therefore, a hydrogen chloride molecule has a total of eight valence electrons, one from the hydrogen plus seven from the chlorine. A peroxide ion has a total of 14 valence electrons. Each oxygen has six valence electrons, but peroxide has a negative two charge, which means two additional electrons. Six plus six plus two equals 14. The nitrogen molecule has a total of 10 valence electrons, five from each of the nitrogen atoms. And the phosphorus fluoride molecule has 12 valence electrons, five from phosphorus, plus seven from fluorine. To summarize, the total number of valence electrons are eight for hydrogen chloride, 14 for peroxide ion, 10 for the, nit the nitrogen molecule, and 12 for the phosphorus fluoride molecule. For diatomic molecules or ions, there are only five unique ways of satisfying the octet or duet rule, and here they are. We can see that only structure two has eight valence electrons. Therefore, we expect the hydrogen chloride molecule to have this structure. There's a single bond between the two atoms and three lone pairs around the chlorine. We can also see that only structure three has 14 valence electrons. Therefore, we expect the peroxide ion to have this structure. There is a single bond between the two atoms and three lone pairs on both atoms. Note that we must enclose the Lewis structure for peroxide in a square bracket and indicate the charge as a superscript. We need to do this for ions. We can see that only structure five has 10 valence electrons. Therefore, we expect the nitrogen molecule to have this structure. There's a triple bond between the two nitrogen atoms and a lone pair on each one. Finally, we can see that only structure four has 12 valence electrons. Therefore, we expect the phosphorus fluoride molecule to have this structure. There's a double bond between the two atoms and two lone pairs on each atom. Since the question is asking for the molecular ion with a double bond, the correct answer is phosphorus fluoride.